How can you multiply two two-digit numbers faster? Pag-usapan natin yan today. Hi there, welcome to Team Laika where we try to help you prepare better for your next exam. And yes, kasama dyan syempre yung speed math techniques. This time, specifically a Vedic math technique. Now, I'm going to cover this kasi maraming nag-tag sa akin dun sa isang TikTok video about a contestant dun sa Little Miss You sa Showtime. And dun sa talent portion niya, eh, nag-solve siya ng isang math problem. And natuwa ako kasi sa totoo lang napanood ko na yung video na yon noong una siyang pinalabas. Uh, nanood ako ng Showtime. And I was really thinking, if I ever have a kid, probably kung usapang talent at mahilig din siya sa math, ganong klase yung talent din yung maisip niyang gawin. But anyway, today we're going to focus specifically on that technique, yung ginawa niya. Pero before we do that, just a quick history lesson on Vedic math or as other people say it, Vedic Maths, my S. Vedic Math or Vedic Mathematics is a collection of techniques to solve math problems faster. So, hindi lang ito isang method, pero iba-ibang methods for different combinations ng numbers. It was discovered by an Indian mathematician named Jagadguru Sri Bharati Krishna Tehaji. And today, we're going to talk about how to multiply two-digit numbers by two-digit numbers. Okay? Let's jump right into it. Alright, so let's try it out with this. 19 times 24. Now, the first step is to multiply yung unang digit, yung tens digit niya. So, we have 1 times 2. Again, the first digits. So, 1 times 2 is 2. Isusulat na natin siya dito. Next, we're going to multiply yung nasa ones digit ng pareho sa kanila or yung nasa last. So, we have 9 times 4. 9 times 4 is 36. So, isusulat lang natin siya dito sa tabi ng 2. 36. Now, this next step is where it gets a little bit tricky. But bear with me, okay? Ang una natin gagawin is multiply yung numbers na nasa outside. Basically, magkocross sila. So, parang foil method natin when we talk about multiplying mga binomials, which we did discuss before. So, if you haven't seen that yet, I'll link ko na lang din dito, no? Pero, yun yung gagawin natin. So, outside muna. We have 1 times 4, which is going to give us 4. Set aside lang muna natin siya. And then, we have yung inside naman. 9 times 2, which is going to give us 18. Idadagdag natin siya ngayon dito sa 4. Now, 4 plus 18 is 22. At yung 22 na yan, ay i-add natin dito, dun sa 236. Quick note na hindi mo siya ilalagay sa dulo. Yung 6 will remain as it is, dito mo siya ilalagay, 22. So, pag in natin siya, ang lalabas is going to be 456. 19 times 22 is 456. Para may proof, gamitan natin ang calculator. We have 19 times 24 equals, see that? Now, of course, you can use yung natsanayan na natin na method. You can use yung method ko, which is 19 times 20 muna, tas 19 times 4. There are different ways to solve this problem. Again, this is just a new way. You can practice and find out kung saan kayo mas mabilis para mapili ninyo kung ano yung gagamitin nyo, kung makikita nyo siya sa mga exams or sa real life applications. Let's do one more, okay? 78 times 46, we're going to start with the tens digits, yung mga nasa harap. So, 7 times 4 is 28. Ilalagay na agad natin dito. Next, you have yung nasa last, which is 8 times 6 or 48 na lang. So, yung 48, lalagay natin dito sa tabi niya. Now, it's important to note na, again, pinagtatabi natin yung dalawang two-digit number na yan. Wala pa tayong ginagawa. Okay? Next, we have yung outside. 7 times 6, which is going to give us 42. Tapos, idadagdag natin yung lalabas doon sa inside, which is 8 times 4. 8, 16, 24, 32. 32 yan. Add natin sila. We have 74. Now, sa natin ilalagay yung 74. Again, iiwanan natin yung last digit ng same lang. So, dito natin nalagay siya. 74. And now, you have 8 here. Another 8 here. 8 plus 7 is 15. So, idadagdag lang natin siya dyan. We have 
3,588. To check 78 times 46, yan, 3,588. Pareho lang. Let me just remind you that if you want more lessons, quizzes, exercises, and mock tests for your next exam covering math, English, language, and logic. We still have our practice test booklets and the workbook available. Kakaristock lang namin sa Team Laika Facebook page. So go ahead and visit m.me slash Team Laika. Message us doon sa page na yon para malaman ninyo how you can get your own. Alright? Okay, now it's time for your quick quiz. If you're ready with your pen and paper, your timer starts now. I just left space dito para masolve natin sila lahat sa isang panel. So you have 1 times 3, which is going to give you 3. And then 7 times 2, which is going to give me 14. Siya yan agad. And then you have outside, which is 1 times 2, which is going to give us 2. Set aside natin yan. Tapos inside, 7 times 3 is 21. So, 2 plus 21 is 23. Dagdag natin dito. Again, leaving your last digit as it is. Now, we have 544. The answer here is 544. Quick check. 17 times 32 equals yan, 544. Next, you have 42 times 63. So, dumula tayo sa first. 4 times 6, 6, 12, 18, 24. So, 24 na agad. Tapos, yung last, which is 2 times 3, which is going to give us 6. Now, kung nagkamali kay dito, it's because hindi nyo siya sinulat as a two-digit number. Ang 6 is actually going to be written as 0, 6. Okay? Now, if you got that wrong, okay lang yan. Hindi ko specify kanina, pero I meant that para mas matandaan nyo itong lesson ito ngayon. Doon naman tayo dun sa outside. So, 4 times 3 is 12 plus... Inside, 2 times 6 is also 12. So, 12 plus 12 is 24. Add natin siya dito. Ang lalabas ay 2646, 2646. To check, 42 times 63 is 2646. Last na, first, 5 times 8 is 40. Last, 2 times 6 is 12. Outside, 5 times 6 is 30. Plus, inside, 2 times 8 is 16. 30 plus 16 is 46. I-add natin dito. Again, keeping yung last digit as it is. So, now you have 4,472. Quick check ulit. 52 times 86 is 4472. As you can see, math can be fun, and there are multiple ways of solving the same problem. Ang importante is that you find a way that works best for you. Meron na tayong another video on this, another technique that I use. You can watch it here, or link it in the description box sa baba. And if you want to support this channel another way, pero nakapasa na kayo, or you just really want to do it because you're having fun learning with me, you can also buy our merch. Available pa rin siya sa shop.teamlaika.com. Dot com. Perfect kasi tag-ulan na ngayon. So yung mga hoodies natin, caps, and other things could help with you know, keeping you warm kahit malamig ang panahon. Okay? So as we always say sa channel na to, never stop learning. Aja-aja, kain yan. I'll see you in my next video and bye for now.